Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's Friday, so we're doing a vape vlog. Hey everyone, so I got a lot of things to talk about in today's vape vlog today. If you're new to my channel, I like to do a vape vlog at the end of every week on Friday where I just chit chat, tell you guys about stuff, tell you guys about vaping stuff, not vaping stuff, answer your questions and things like that. So let's get started with my e-liquid of the week. Now it was so super tough to pick a winner for the, my e-liquid of the week and um, <laughs> I, it really is a toss-up, so I really, really like Juicy Ohm's Ohm Sweet Ohm. It is a cereal type vape and it is really good, but I really, really liked Suck My Juice's Crazy Girl Eyes. Both equally good vapes, both completely different too, and so if I had to pick, I, I would have to go with Crazy Girl's. It's just such a unique dessert flavor, but this is such a close second. Like, this is like... This is like first place, and this is like first and a half place. And then second place would be these all day vape. Alright, so I'm going to jump over to your guys' questions and comments on YouTube. And uh, well, the first one, the first one I want to, the first comment I want to address is a shout out to a new vapor, new vapor alert, Zed Russell commented on the 14th got mine yesterday and he's referring to the iStick mini which I love and he says I'm equally happy about its functionality feel and look my first electronic quitting smoking aid wish me luck good luck and I really think the iStick mini is great for a beginner pair it with the Nautilus mini or the GS16S atomizer if you don't mind a small tank the next shout out I want to give is to Kristen Scarf says, Tia, I so appreciate your kind and helpful videos. You are a dear lady. I smoked since 1985 and started vaping in July of last year. I'm so glad to be done forever with the cancer sticks. Congratulations. Keep on vaping. I mean, you're almost to a year. July soon, right? I want it to be summer. Okay, so this comment is from Monkey Lover 68 I'm assuming that's what it's. M-N-K-Y-L-U-V-R. And... They write, I ordered the Graze Box, which if you guys watch this channel, I've showed my grave I've showed my Graze Box the last couple weeks because they're just so good and they're just the greatest snacks ever. Anyways, um, Monkey Lover ordered the Graze Box. I gave you guys a code you could use for a free box, which I'll also link that below. Loved it so much, ate them all by the end of the day, <laughs> waiting for the next one next week. Just wanted to pull that comment out of there because I was really interested in whether you guys enjoyed, because there's a lot of people that signed up for Grays. I just wanted to know if you guys enjoyed the snacks or what you think of it. And so if you don't already know, I have the Grays box. I get it every other week, but because I got a free box for um, referring more than three people, I had a box each week this for the last couple weeks and I, so I just got my regular scheduled one because you can get it every week but I have it scheduled every once every two weeks and it's $6.99 a box unless you refer a friend then you get the dollar off so mine was $5.99 and it came with some awesome I didn't think I was gonna like this this says fruity mango chutney with black pepper dippers like that doesn't sound appealing to me and but I tried it and oh my god it's so good this one is sour cream and onion in cashews I, it is really good too bum this one down here is called beach bum and it has um, pineapple dried pineapple coconut flakes and chewy banana coins really good and my favorite out of this box like hello is cookies and cream it's cookies and cream and it has mini cookies white chocolate hazelnuts and sunflower seeds see it's a mini cookie and this is the white chocolate and it also comes with um the nutritional facts for everything and the ingredients as well as I was reading this this is actually a product of the UK that's what it says product of the United Kingdom oh my gosh but I love it like I said if you want to sign up for it and check it out you can get your first box free and if you don't like it you can cancel it I'll give you guys a code and but if you do stick with it then you also get your fifth box for free big uncle Shirley I'm almost four months off after 30 years on the cigarettes that is awesome congratulations Welcome to the vape fam, Uncle Shirley. Okay, so I noticed a lot of comments on last week's vape vlog where I showed you guys some foreign comments uh, that were typed in like Russian, Chinese, 
and I asked you guys if you could tell me if you knew what they said and yes I know there's Google Translate but the reason I asked you guys is because Google Translate it really doesn't come out right like it comes out so weird and so I just wanted to know if any of the anybody out there was fluent in any of the languages and could tell me like you know exactly what it says because the translate sometimes is like what the heck East TN Vapor has been smoke-free since November 24th, 2014. Way to go! I'm guessing that's East Tennessee Vapor? So I asked you guys last week to give me some suggestions for Netflix shows and I got a lot and they're really awesome. But I'm restarting Burn Notice because there's like seven seasons and I only ever got to like season maybe two and a half, I think. I don't know if you guys know that, but it, I love it. It's about spies, and it's really cool. I'm on, like, the fifth episode. Jerry Shannon said that I gotta watch Game of Thrones or The Walking Dead. Girl. Girl. Those are my shows. I follow along on The Walking Dead every Sunday, and I can't wait for Game of Thrones to start again. Eric Haven says, both me and my wife quit smoking in November 2013. That is awesome. It's over a year smoke-free. Congratulations, you two. Alex Hall has been off cigarettes for two months. Welcome to the vape fam. Keep going. Find your perfect vape. Kevin Vige is eight days smoke-free. Tough but doable with vaping. Yes, it is. I know it's tough in the beginning, but you can do it. And this was on the 15th. This was posted on the 15th. So let me know, Kevin, if you're still vaping strong. Really funny, Kevin Green. Really funny. Now below, you can tell me what it really means, okay, Kevin? Two Kevins in a row. Okay, really quickly, I wanted to talk about my mod sock again. So this is my mod sock, and it holds my MVP 20 watt. And this was made for me by... Alice and Russell, I believe the name is. I hope I'm, I got that right. And they make these custom. They have a little store, so I will put a link to where you can get custom-made mod socks like this. And they're also coming out with ones for the MVP version 3 as well, because these will fit all the prior MVP models, but not the newest one. And while I'm telling you about that little charm, I also want to tell you about this little charm. I didn't properly get to show this to you guys. Like, I just... We need to appreciate how well done this vape charm is. It is super, super cute. This is by The Zombie Boutique. And I will put a link below to that website as well. But it's just so freaking cute. It needed to be appreciated more. So, I wanted to show you guys it up and close. But this is, this is from a different, so the Mod Sock and this charm are from different places, but I'll put links below to both places because these are really awesome. These are really quality made vape accessories. Hannah Loves You All commented on my video where I told you guys about my grandpa being in the hospital. I'm actually trying to do this video quickly because I'm going down to see him this evening. But anyways, on that video, it was a while ago, um, he's been in the hospital for a couple weeks and I'll have to continue to stay in the hospital. Um, but Hannah commented that she was sending me prayers and that she's also in the same situation, that her grandfather is in the ER as well. And I just wanted to let you know that I am thinking of your grandpa, Hannah, and prayers to you and I hope that everyone that's watching this can give prayers to Hannah and her grandfather as well. It is hard to lose loved ones and yes I know everyone gets old and everyone's gotta die but it's still hard to deal with especially when this is the first time that I've had to face something like this. April Hill switched to e-cigs about a month ago and is now three weeks cig free. Congratulations April! And she's asking if I have a Pinterest page and I do have a Pinterest page. I will link that below. I mostly use Pinterest for recipes and things like that. I have a board specifically for food that like recipes that are interesting to me, recipes that I've tried and I've liked, and recipes that I've tried and I didn't like because I'm like so Pinterest is mainly for recipes because I love to cook. Mervy is asking why don't you build Tia? Well I've addressed this a lot of times and I just I just it's not my style of vaping I don't want to spend the time to make the coils and with all the newer technology that they're coming out with like before these kind of sub tanks you could only sub ohm if you built your own coils but now you don't have to now they're doing it for you and I just it's tedious and I just that's just not my style of vaping and I do it every so often like once in a blue moon I'll do a rebuildable or mech mod review but it's just not where I am going with my vaping journey so my channel is going to stay like at the beginner intermediate regulated mods and things like that for beginners and newer vapors. There are awesome channels for advanced vaping though and I am loving this iStick 50 watt and Kanger mini setup. It, it just blows so much clouds and it's such good flavor. I picked mine up from ePuff store. 
And that reminds me, Epuff Store is doing like an extreme sale right now for the SVD version 2. That's this beast guy right here. So they're doing a sale. It's normally like, what, $130? And it's on sale right now for $79. But Epuff Store does free shipping over $30 for orders within the U.S. I have no idea how long the sale is going on, but I'll leave a link below if you want to get in and get this um, almost half off. Okay, so I didn't announce this on my YouTube channel because I said I wasn't going to. So I did a super secret giveaway over on EER. I tweeted about it and I Facebooked about it, but I didn't say it on YouTube here because I wanted it to just be a secret giveaway. And so quite a few of you discovered, but a lot of you asked, what's EER? Because I only tweeted secret giveaway on EER. That's Epic eSig Reviews, and that's the forum at epicesigreviews.com. I will link below, and you can join the forum and register and get into any giveaways that we host over there. Our smokers and I are actually running a giveaway over there as well right now for an MVP 20 watt. Make sure you follow me on all the other social medias because I'll be doing a lot of giveaways on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram. I have a ton of stuff to give away. Damn, I love this thing. But anyways, just a quick vape vlog for you guys this week because I gotta go visit my grandpa. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up and feel free to subscribe to my channel for more reviews. Check the description box below for important links as well as links to my favorite things like e-liquids, mods, etc. You can follow me on almost any social media site like Instagram or Twitter at Tia Vapes. I also have a Facebook page, facebook.com slash Tia Reviews. If you don't get enough of me here, I do have a second vlog channel here on YouTube where I upload random videos of whatever I want. So if you want to see videos of me that aren't vaping related, you can go check out that channel. And one more thing before you go, if vaping is something you're passionate about, please consider joining Kasa.org and fight for your right to vape. So as always, I'm Tia Vapes, and thank you so much for watching, guys.